In this video, we will understand buoyancy. In the animation, we can see a tank is partially filled with water and immerse it into the water. When we release the ball, we see that ball bounces back to the surface of the water. If we repeat the process, we see the same result. So, why does this happen? Let's understand this by this animation. When we try to immerse the ball into the water, the ball displaces some water which is equal to its volume. And because of that, water level increases. On the surface of the water, atmospheric pressure is acting. Because of that, water tries to come back to its own position. And this creates an upward thrust on the plastic ball. So the plastic ball bounces back to the surface of the water. This upward thrust exerted by the water is known as buoyancy. In fact, all objects experience a force of buoyancy when they are immersed in a fluid. The magnitude of this buoyant force depends on the density of the fluid. Take another scenario in which we immerse an iron ball instead of plastic ball. Now, we see that this iron ball completely sinks into the water. This is because the mass of the iron ball is very large as compared to the mass of plastic ball. Therefore, the downward force due to gravity is greater than the upward thrust. So that the iron ball completely sinks into the water. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe our channel.